Hi guys, Dom Goes here. I just came back from vacation, which explains why I'm so tan now and not white anymore. But speaking of skin color, this is the AC750 Deer 818LW router from Dealing. Now this is the very first AC router on the market that comes in four colors. And naturally, I have all of them. Now, wait. Here we go. There you go. Black, white, orange, and teal. No discrimination. But very randomly, let's pick one for a closer look. There you go. Good choice. As you can see, this is a very compact router. In fact, it's almost compact enough to be a travel router, though not quite. On the back here, you can see there are usual four LAN port and one WAN or Ethernet port. All of these ports, though, are gigabit, which is very impressive for a router of this size. And there's also this USB 2.0 here to host a storage device. On the front, there are two indicator lights. The top here is for the power starters, and the one below is for the rest. If it's green, everything is okay. If it's amber, something needs attention. Now on the inside, the router here is a lot less impressive. For one, it actually supports the slowest speed of the 802.11 AC Wi-Fi standard to offer the top speed on the 5 GHz frequency band of just 433 Mbps. On the 2.4 GHz band, it supports the second tier of the 802.11 N Wi-Fi standard with a top speed of 300 Mbps. Now note though, those speeds are on the paper. The real world sustained speed of the Wi-Fi is always a lot slower than that. And with this one here, it was slow indeed. In my testing, it offered the sustained speed of just 136 megabit per second on the 5 gigahertz band and only 36 megabit per second on the 2.4 gigahertz band. And that is when I tested in the close 15 feet range. When I increased the range further out, it was much slower. Basically, it's about as fast as a good N600 router. Now, this one here also has very short range, which is about 120 feet away. And that means it will not work well in a large home. But if you live in a small apartment or a studio, it will do just fine. Now, to make up for that, the router here support dealing cloud service, allowing you to manage your home network remotely with the internet, including a mobile app for that. In all, though, I don't feel like it has enough to justify the $80 price tag. The good news is, this white one here can be had right now for just about $60, and now that's a good deal if you live in a small home. Now, for more on this one here, check out my full review at CNET.com. By the way, since I have all four of them here, I did think about giving them away to make myself look friendly and likable. But then I realized that would be so unnecessary because you like me already even if you think you don't. And that's because I'm Dongo, and this has been the first look at the Deer 818LW router from Billy. Yes, I have all of this for me.